Welcome back to my channel, my dear lovely viewers. <coughs> Sorry for my voice. Uh, I kind of have cold, so please just bear with my voice. I, I don't know how long this update will take, so I have to just do the video. So here, the video is uh, centered on Aftermath or the Sweet Blockchain. Uh, Aftermath is w one of their biggest perpetual uh, platform, and you know what it means when I say perpetual platform. You can see how Hyperliquid did, and I'm just hoping we might have something interesting from Aftermath as well. I'm not saying it will be as big as Aftermath because Aftermath is one of the big, it, if not the biggest airdrop I've seen ever since I joined this space. I've seen people claim one million dollar a day about. So here. A quick one you what we need to do right now is to do everything possible or aftermath everything available or aftermath so here what the first thing i did i actually made a video earlier before now but unfortunately i was not able to post it on my youtube channel i had technical issues so i had to make another one that's why you see i've already done most of the tasks so it will just be like a, a guide now to show you how i went about the video so here the first thing you need to do is we need to go we have you know all three we have native and we have liquid staking and here the first thing we'll do is we'll be staking or native staking which is after you click on stake more three or yours might not be st showing stake more because you don't have anything staked for example if you don't have anything staked all you see is stake so whichever one just click on stake then select native staking when you pick on native staking, you have to select any validator validator of your choice. But because we are running aftermath, we will be selecting aftermath, which is this, and stake any amount. Well, I would advise don't stake less than one sweet. So stake like one sweet or so. Once you click on one sweet here, then you click on stake now. So once you click on stake now, you verify and you stake because I've already staked, so I don't have any point of staking. And uh, yes, I know a lot of you will be asking, ah, eh, but how, if I stake now, how long will it take for me to unstake? Just pay attention, you see that. So here, the second thing, we'll click on stake once again, we we'll go for liquid staking, we'll still pick aftermath. Well, if you notice, Seth, in the liquid staking, we have only three tokens, either V3 or Heidel or aftermath. This should tell you, a lot of things that aftermath is something you should take very important for you to have it all. so what i'm just saying is aftermath is they don't have a native token yet and i believe bringing up their native token might bring us a drop and that is why that's the speculation and that's why i'm making this video and i need you guys to take it very very seriously so once we do this we click on aftermath for liquid staking you put the amount of three you click on stake as well once you click on stake now you stake that as well so after staking for those wondering how long will it take for me to be able to or stake whatever it is i i stake click on view details after staking then you call, go to for native token you see it shows this start any in 33 hours so your edit will start in 33 hours and after that at three hours once the edit starts at that moment you can withdraw all these uh whatever it is you stake immediately it doesn't there is no vesting period there is no holding period there is no cooling period it is immediate after that house so here uh, for after uh, for liquid staking liquid staking even immediately you stake for liquid staking here you go back to on liquid stake if you want to unstake that one is immediate and whatever it is you stake on liquid staking it will be shown in your portfolio this is for my the third one after my three af3 so you see add stake said swap or unstake once you click on unstake it will unstake automatically so once i click on unstake i'll put the amount i want to unstake there i'll click unstake now it will unstake immediately so that's the difference between that's why you see that what i stake under the liquid staking it's much more uh, is what much more than what i have on native stock uh, stake because in case i want to do it immediately i can just withdraw immediately so that's why so that's that for the staking part for aftermath the next task we'll be doing is to go to the apps on that application we have uh, aftermath.finance which is uh here and uh, please a quick one to remind you all this is not a test set this is mainnet you are using real fonts you are not using test token 
we i have a video where i make how to go about running the test net as well we've done the test net earlier before now if you're just joining this channel or you're just seeing this video for the first time check the video description section you see a video link for the test net on how to go about everything on the test net as well so so make sure you watch the test net do the test net before you now come ahead or after the bayonet you can still go ahead to do the test net it is very important but bayonet is always always very important most times projects even put bayonet users over test net users because they believe bayonet users are their real supporters because they were willing and ready to use their funds to support the project so here we we'll click on launch app so once you come here one thing i need to remind every single one of you is that uh when they said trade volume on the decks like on a swapping platform like this when you are swapping it doesn't mean you will swap with one thousand dollars no for example if your plan is to have a one thousand dollar volume on aftermath all you need to do if you don't have up to one thousand dollars you can have just hundred dollars and swap ten times you have already done one thousand dollar volume if you have ten dollar and you swap ten ten dollar for hundred times you already have one thousand dollar volume you understand the jack that's how it works so you don't have to use one thousand dollar at it at once for you to be able to do one thousand dollar volume it is very very important from what i said now i believe you know how to grow your volume on any decks so that's that so here for example i want to just grow let's say i want to use wild sui volume i'll just pull one sui then i click on trade via aftermath i swap to usdc i swap to usdc for example and the fee is actually quite fair it's very very fair finalized and it is very very fast it's just like hop.ag as well that's hop aggregator and here if you remember some of you that don't use hop uh, i got uh, i was eligible for bluefin airdrop just because i do use hop aggregator imagine using aftermath uh, and another airdrop aside aftermath calls and they said they partner with aftermath and uh, because you've used aftermath decks they will give you a drop so that's another way it's not just about just working for aftermath alone Partners that are partners with Aftermath can also a drop Aftermath user. That is how you go about a drops. You use one stone to kill multiple birds. That's how it works. So now after that, you can swap back once again. You swap max. I'll just max. Swap back to three. It means I have done two three volume already just by doing this swap back and forth. So here, once I click this, sorry. So you can see it's done as well so i've swapped back you can see the fee say i was having 2.88 and i'm still having 2.88 because the fee is so low so which means it is very very cheap just try and get one or two sweet keep swapping that one sweet keep swapping it keep swapping it for as much as you can just keep doing that as much as you can i believe it will end up paying I believe it will end up paying so i uh, so thank you very much guys for watching my video i'll be dropping a link to join after uh, aftermath finance which is this my referral link and i'll be dropping a video uh in the video description section as well i'll be dropping the video for um the test net for aftermath so thank you very much guys for watching and i will always make sure i drop updates that will pay and uh, don't forget to subscribe and like and also share with your friends and relatives thank you very much